Those heavy rains are wreaking havoc on the football schedule tonight. Only a few teams are playing in the soggy conditions tonight, but does that choice come with greater risks? Yeah, our Riley Livingston talks with sports medicine experts about the possible dangers. She joins us live in the studio with more. Muddy fields, slick surfaces, and damp gear, all elements that could potentially add up to disaster. But sometimes it's just the opposite. You can't control Mother Nature, and that means high school football players sometimes find themselves playing in less than ideal conditions. And while some people might think football and wet field conditions would be a recipe for injuries, athletic trainer David Ruffin says that's not always the case. Anytime you slow the game down, it slows the speed of which people are hitting one another, cuts back on some of the head injuries. And as far as the lower leg injuries, most knee and ankle injuries happen well, I say a lot of them happen because the foot sticks in the ground and they turn or they get hit and the, the cleats stick. When it's wet and muddy, the cleats really won't stick. When the rain starts falling, coaches look at the field. We're very fortunate uh, that we're playing at JA this weekend. They have a turf field. Uh, so the idea of the surface, uh, the playing surface is not going to be as bad. If you're playing on a you know, wet grass field, there is a more potential sometimes for injury, but it really is really football. While injuries are a constant concern, rain also poses other problems. Uh, the equipment is what's important because obviously, you know, the headsets can ruin. That's mm -hmm. going to cost you money. Balls can ruin. That's 80 bucks a pop. If you let those get too soaked, too heavy, they can be ruined. And so there's a lot of money, unfortunately, involved in this whole thing. Uh, so that's going to be the big part of just trying to make sure you take care of the stuff that can be ruined and have to be replaced. Rain or shine, the game goes on. Well, field of play is going to be wet. There's nothing to do with it. The guys are going to be wet. There's nothing to do about it. Anytime you step out on the field, you have a risk of getting injured. Uh, most of the coaches are pretty good about keeping an eye on their kids. They know the kids are there with them every day. So if something looks off, and we're usually there anyway at practice and games, so we get to know the kids. So we just we keep an eye on them. For highlights and scores of those opting to play tonight, as well as those who took the field last night, join us for WCBI Endzone at 10.